Okay, today I'd like to talk about the plague that is political correctness. Political correctness is literally making retards out of all of us. Here's a few examples. Barbar Black Sheep, the classic children's nursery rhyme, is now considered racist by school in East Melbourne. Staff at a school in Melbourne have expressed their concerns over the connotations of black, which does not reflect Australia's multicultural society. Dildos are now racist. Professor Amy Suryoshi of San Francisco University is teaching that dildos that look like white penises are designed to look appealing, while dildos that look like black penises are big and scary. I mean, you couldn't make this shit up. Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are now racist. Principal Kataras of Harvey Scott School, Oregon, claim students from Mexico or Somalia may feel excluded because their cultures don't eat bread. Therefore, serving these sandwiches is a brazen display of white privilege. But it don't stop there. The retardation continues. Students ban racist sombreros. September 2015, East Anga University. Union officials tell restaurant staff that the hats breached a policy forbidding discriminatory or stereotypical imagery. This bullshit is only happening in white countries. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs become Snow White and the Seven Friends. De Mumford Hall in Leicester changed the name because dwarf is not a term people feel comfortable with. I feel comfortable with it, and I'm sure many dwarfs do too. Surely this just ostracises dwarfs further. Crematorium removes cross to avoid offending non-Christians. Oh, think of the children. Then of course there's the Tom and Jerry race fiasco on Amazon over the maid being black, implying black people can only get low-end jobs. And James Bond should not be fucking black. I mean, come on. If Bond can be black, then so can Indiana Jones. But who the fuck wants to see a black Indiana Jones? Bond is a white character and should remain white. End of fucking story. In other news, gollywogs are awesome. Muhammad was a fucking paedophile. And transsexual women still look like men. You can't hide it, ladies. You used to be a bloke. Oh, you can't say that. Oh, I can't say that. You can say that. The point I'm trying to make is, and if I've offended anyone, fuck ya. The point I'm trying to make is, all political correctness has done is got everyone walking around on eggshells worrying about what they can and can't say. And this undercurrent of fear and tension is far more disharmonious to society than simply being allowed freedom of speech in the first place. And I for one am sick of it because it's turned what was once a strong, great nation into a bunch of overly sensitive namby-pambies. So my advice is, say what you want, speak your mind. If someone gets offended, fuck them. Because a few offended people is the lesser of two evils next to this nanny state mentality that's fucking infected society. So if someone gets offended, fuck them. And that's all I've got to say. Fuck him, fuck them too.